Hi everybody and uh, welcome to our channel audio video and music entertainment. Uh, uh, I've just come from work and uh, I was checking my YouTube comments and stuff and somebody asked me uh, whether the cable modem mode is working on the Virgin Media Hub 3.0 or not. Uh, basically I haven't tested it uh, so just gonna test it with you guys uh, on the computer screen so while I'm recording this uh, I'm just gonna show you the computer screen as well uh, before I go ahead and do that uh, the physical connection works in a way that uh, once the Virgin Media Hub 3.0 is in cable mode you take a uh, Ethernet connection from Virgin Media via LAN cable and connect it to the WAN port on another router so for this demonstration I'm using uh, a TP-Link router and uh, I'm just gonna use this port right here uh, the blue one WAN port and uh, just gonna connect the LAN cable Ethernet cable to it and that's about it so I'm just gonna do the connection now and uh, So on the on the actual computer screen I'm going to log on to Virgin Media now and uh, let's see It's uh, pretty simple it's pretty basic setup nothing complicated in it but somebody asked me whether is is it working at this stage or not because I know Virgin Media have been rolling few firmware updates uh, on this uh, router lately Okay, so as you can see that I'm already logged on to my Virgin Media Hub. So I'm gonna go to cable modem mode right here. And it gives me two options basically, enable uh, modem mode or enable router mode. At the moment, uh, router mode is enabled. And if I go on and click on the information icon or logo, it says that once uh, it's running in uh, modem mode, then the IP address would change to 192.168.100.1, which is a class C uh, network, uh, but obviously it's a different sub-network uh, than uh, my other router. But obviously they're going to be able to communicate with each other. Okay, so I'm just going to go and uh, enable uh, the modem mode. Apply changes. Okay, so I've applied the changes now, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to connect to my other router. Okay, no, hold on, sorry, it's saying that uh, I need to log on in order to make changes, so just going to pause the video for a sec. So I enable the cable modem mode and uh, now I'm going to go ahead and connect with my other router. Sorry, just going to go back and connect to basically it didn't enable the modem mode. Okay, so I'm just going to go here now and now enable modem mode and apply changes and uh, apply changes the main reason it asked me twice is because i wasn't logged on to the router and now it's doing its thing in the meanwhile i'm just going to go connect to my other router and this router is based on uh, ddwrt firmware which is for advanced users and uh, it basically what DDWRT does is it opens every function possible on the router and it's advanced routing wireless and wired wise uh, okay so I'm using this and uh, my IP address is 192.168 DHCP service is enabled on my other router advanced routing mode I'm going to use it as a gateway so I can uh, have data coming on my WAN port from Virgin Media Hub to this router. Okay guys, uh, finally it took some time for uh, Virgin Media Hub to uh, update itself as uh, cable modem uh, uh, mode and uh, 
uh, basically it took about two three minutes uh, for it to update it to cable modem mode and assign my router uh, the proper uh, IP addresses and stuff so it could go on the internet uh, uh, one more thing I want to mention is once the Virgin Media Hub is running in uh, cable modem mode then the front LED turns purple so that's the indication that it's running in this mode and uh, everything is fine it's forwarding the internet data to your uh, other main router uh, okay so if you can see on the uh, computer screen uh, if I go on the van side here are my public IP addresses and all that okay so let's test the connection google.co.uk and basically I'm on it and let's uh, Bloomberg so there you go and uh, obviously as I said that the IP address changes to 192.168.100.1 let's ping it so next time if you want to change uh, from cable modem mode uh, to main router mode you don't have to connect uh, a wire to your virgin hub and uh, to change it what you can do is just simply go here and put 192.168.100.1 and uh, it will connect to your virgin media hub uh, log on to it and then just change the cable mode uh, okay so whoever asked this uh, uh, question uh, there you go I've put the video and uh, the uh, cable modem mode on Virgin Media Hub 3.0 it's working fine and uh, it could probably help uh, somebody out there as well alright guys if you have liked this video please click on the like icon and I'll keep making good videos and uh, I can only uh, make good good videos with your support and stuff uh, so please subscribe to the channel and like the videos thank you guys cheers have a good evening